Hello my lovelies and welcome, <laughs> that was a bit dramatic, hello. Hello my lovelies and welcome back to my channel and another video. Today's video is super exciting. Now all my videos are exciting but this one in particular is super excited, exciting because I was kindly contacted by a company called Snack Surprise UK. Now they are a monthly subscription box where they send you a box out every month you have a different country that the box is a full of snacks from. So this month's box is from South Korea. So it's super exciting because every month you were gonna get a box full of snacks from a different country. I mean, how exciting can that be? Like, I think, you know, when you, from working in tourism all my life, I've always found it very fascinating when people from all different cultures come into the shop and then they're like amazed by shortbread, which is a Scottish traditional um, snack. Um, and I'm always amazed by it. So I've always been fascinated to see what other countries are eating, what their favorite snacks are. So when Snackbox, Snack Surprise UK contacted me and said they'd love to send me a box of snacks from a different country, I was absolutely thrilled to receive the box and review it and show you guys everything that's in it because I've already had a little sneak peek and it's absolutely amazing. I just think it's interesting to see what other cultures are eating and I think this would be a fab gift for somebody, for a child and a fab gift for child, teenager, adult, it's, it's just a fab gift for any age range, but especially children, I think this is a fantastic gift so they can see what other children are eating in different countries, what their favorite sweets are, and yeah, it's just a fantastic idea. They do two different boxes, so there's a premium box and an original box. So the original box where you get eight to 10 snacks is 12.99 a month, and the premium box, which I think this is the box they sent me, you, you get 16 to 20 snacks and it's 23.99 and that's including postage and all that sort of stuff. I think that is really reasonable compared to other um, subscription boxes that are out there at the moment. You always expect to pay between 10 to sort of 20 pounds. So I think that's a really good value for money. And yeah, I'm gonna review this um, box for you guys. I'm so excited. I'm feeling like I'm wanting to add more of a review of monthly subscription boxes onto my channel because I love watching them to see what exciting things people get in there, different like glossy box, birch box. I used to love these types of reviews um, and used to get them myself. But I just stopped when I moved out and I was cutting back on finances and all that sort of stuff, boring stuff. So yeah, if you'd like to see me do more reviews of subscription boxes, please let me know in the comments. Tag your favorite subscription boxes and maybe I could do little reviews every other month. Maybe we'll do like a new review of a different subscription box. But for now, we're gonna head on in to South Korea and we're gonna go and have a look at what treats they eat. So here is the review of the Snack Surprise UK box. If you are new be around here, may I just add, please hit that subscribe button for lots more fun videos and if you are a regular, hit that thumbs up button. Woo, let's go. <laughs> also, let's address my hair today. I've got like space buns in because I just feel like, let's just be a bit funky delicious today. So here is the box. It is huge. It has, as I said, a lot of items in it. So I'm just gonna like, pick out randomly and explain what the items are because, wow, these look cool. Honey flavored twist snack. So these are honey and apple flavor, it says. They almost look like the kind of, they just look very different. They're twisted, which kind of excites me because I like things like that. So they're basically honey twist snack, twisted crispy snack with Korean, Honey, it is pleasant to eat for its interesting twisted shape. Now I'm not gonna lie, I'm very, I like the texture of sweet, so if it's like a kind of texture like that, I'm for it. Um, they look cool and um, cannot wait to try them. Next thing, I know my little sister will be like highly excited about this if I give take one round to her. So these are called Mallow Cow Chewing Candy. Sweet and chewy milk candy that has a fluffy texture your box can include strawberry or milk flavor, so I think I've got strawberry. Um, and they just kind of look like a bubble gum almost, like a, a, like a Korean version of our uh, bubble gum. Um, so yeah, that looks really cute. And I just love the writing on the package. I just think that's such a vibe. Like they're, it's, this is just so cool. That's what they go in their shops and pick up, like, oh, I will have one of these. And we would go into our shop and be like, oh, can we get some bubble gum? But that's what they pick up, so cool. This one is right up my street. So we've got hot chicken flavor ramen. As you all know, if you've been a regular on this channel, I have always loved my, well, not always actually, I have, I love cocoa chicken noodles. It's like my second gal, you know, I had them for breakfast this morning. I love my cocoa chicken noodles. So these will be so exciting to try, see what we think about them, but they are hot 
chicken flavoured noodles. Now, I know my little brother, he is 12 years old, he absolutely loves trying different foods. So the minute I showed my dad this box, my, um, my dad was like, I FaceTimed, I was like, Dad, my box and snack, box, snack Surprise UK box has come, I'm so excited. And he said to me, oh my goodness, that looks amazing, I might have to order your brother one. So I think my dad's even going to jump on the bandwagon and get my little brother a, little, a monthly subscription. So I just think it's such a good idea. So basically, they're hot chicken flavoured noodles. Excuse that nail, I did my nails the other day and one's chipped. Um, and yeah, there's nothing much more I can say about them, but they look pretty spicy and interesting. Then got another couple of packet of crisps in there. We've got a sweet potato snack. They look really good, actually, them ones. Sweet potato snack, um, and it says these ones say, let's have a look what it says in the, You get a little manual with every, uh, for every item, it tells you different things about it. So the, this one says it's a delicious crunchy snack. It is a perfect combination of sweet potatoes and maple syrup. So I'm kind of getting a vibe that they're like honey and syrupy kind of vibes in Korea. Um, but yeah, really like them. The cute packaging. I just, I'm going to go on a dog walk um, later on tonight and I'm going to take a packet of these for me and my dad to try on the walk. So these look really exciting. Next thing I have got is shrimp flavoured crackers. Now these are a bit of me. Anything fishy? or like seafood-y, I'm there. So, the hot and spicy shrimp, shrimp flavoured crackers. They look so good. Now, what does it say about them? Does it say anything in particular? Designed in the shape of a French fry and made from fresh flour and ground shrimp. Let's just try one now while we're here. They smell interesting. Wow. They are amazing. They're like prawn crackers. It's all, they're really nice. So basically, they're really nice. Shrimp flavoured crackers. Um, yeah, I'll be having them after dinner tonight. Lush. Next thing that was in the box is these Pepero Golden Crunchy Peanut Pretzels. So these are basically delicious crunchy biscuit sticks that are super addictive and your box may include white cookie, almond or peanut and pretzel flavour. So I've got the peanut ones and these kind of remind me of the Mikado biscuits we've got. You know those long ones with the long sticks with like the chocolate on the end? That's what this kind of reminds me of and they do look really good. Like look at that. I'm going to be snacking all night long tonight. Lou is my other half. Um, if anyone is new to my channel and doesn't know that. He saw the box before he went out golfing just then. He was like, oh, Harriet, that looks amazing. I'm like, I know, boo. I know. Look really yummy. Next thing in the box is this kind of like custard style kind of soft cake, it says. So that's it there. And it says in the information booklet about it, a golden sponge cake filled with a flavoured packet custard cream. It is best enjoyed with a cup of coffee. I'm honestly amazed by this box so far. I love the fact that we are trying, experimenting new foods and I love it. And I always, as I said, I always find it fascinating when working in tourism, um, when different people come into the shop. And I always find it amazing that they're just like fascinated by like our food that we're so used to. So like we get people from all over the world, different cultures coming in and they're like, wow, shortbread and to us in Scotland, working in a shop. Shortbread's nothing different for us. Or like oat cakes and things like that. That's like a traditional Scottish food and they're always amazed by it. But I suppose wherever you go on holiday or wherever you travel and explore, you're always amazed by their food in their culture. So I'm totally amazed by that. So that is a little custard cake thing. It doesn't say anything about it in the manual, but yeah, it just looks like a basic cake with a bit of custard in the middle. Lou will be having that later because I don't like custard, but he loves it. Next thing we got is some kind of like loose, chewy sweets at the bot bottom of the box. You've got like a strawberry flavour, an apple flavour and a blueberry. And I think they're just kind of like, they're just like a chewy sweet. Um, but they look maybe good for my pocket on my dog walk. Then got these. These look right up my street. They're like blueberry sort of flavoured and it says chewy natural fruit jelly sweets great as a quick snack and kids love it you can either get grape or peach flavor so thank goodness i got grape flavor because it's my fave um 
purple looking sweet. I'm a, such a sucker. I used to be more of like a crisp kind of gal, but now I'm swaying towards more of like the sweets because I've just grown a sweet tooth over the last few months. So these are gonna be, I'm so excited to eat these. Next thing in the box is so cute. Look at that. Look at the packaging. It says Choco Boy um, with loads of like chocolate uh, mushrooms. Now they come to a grand total of sweet crunchy biscuits topped with milk chocolate cat. These mushroom shaped biscuits are so simple yet so addictive. So I'm hyped to try these because they just look really good. They, they remind me of, you know the bears we get, it, we used to get in our pack up lunch boxes, or the little chocolate bears. Do, you, do you, does anyone know what I mean? Like there was like a biscuit and then a bit of chocolate. These kind of give me that vibe that's like a biscuit and a bit of chocolate and it's something you'd put in like a kid's pack lunch box or something, but yeah, love it. Next thing we've got a fresh berry kind of like squishy cake. Now, let's see what it says about it. Oh, here we are. Fresh berry pie. So this is a sweet and light cream mixed with fresh berries such as strawberries and then between, and so it's basically like strawberries with a two sandwich um, cakes on the top, fluffy cake on the top. So basically like a little strawberry, little um, Victoria sponge in there for you. Um, I love the fact they're into maybe like spongier sweets than we are in the UK. Next thing we got, similar, okay, similar idea to what I was just saying about the little chocolate bears that we used to get in our packed lunchbox. These are called Choco Biscuits. So they've got like a hard shell around them and then melted chocolate in the middle and they look so yummy. So let's have a look in the manual and see what their description of them is. Named for the, when's that right? Named for the prank played by Korean children, these crunchy biscuits are filled with delicious chocolate. Can't wait to have one of these with a cup of tea. Now these are like a bit out there and I just instantly know my little brother would love something like this. So they're called Homerum Ball Choco and crispy pastry balls with a rich chocolate filling. They are classic Korean snack and are sure to hit a home run in your house. So these are just like a classic, apparently a classic chocolate sweet in Korea, in South Korea. Um, and I just find their packaging totally cool. Like you would never go into the into our supermarkets in the UK and find that on the shelf. It would just be a average Cadbury's chocolate bar. You wouldn't be getting fancy shiny packaging like that. The packaging's so different from what we have in the UK and I just love it. Next we've got a couple of fruit juices. So first of all we've got Milkis soda, one of the most popular drinks in Korea. It combines the traditional fizz of a soda with the creamy taste of milk and slight tang of yogurt. That is totally different from what we would have in the UK, isn't it? Like that is so different. Um, yeah, it's, it's a bit out there. It looks cool, the packaging's cool. It looks like um, maybe like an energy drink kind of vibe that we'd get in the UK, but obviously it's just like a fizzy, milky drink. Um, I'm sure that will be so I actually do not like milk, but this would be totally out there Like you just wouldn't think in the UK. There's no soda kind of milk drink you can get here So it's a bit different loving it though And the other thing we've got is something right up my street It's a little orange juice and it says sack sack orange a refreshing and sweet orange flavored drink It's a hundred percent pure squeezed orange juice and it's filled with pulp now I'm not really sure what pulp is, but I really like it. I'm going to take this in my car on my dog walk and drink it on the way there. It's about a 15 minute drive. Absolutely love that. Um, a bit different. It's a bit out there, isn't it? And I just think it's such a cute little sized can as well. Like the, the can is just a really good size. I don't like drinking things that are really big, um, like that sort of size. This is just perfect. I then have something that is exciting me because I love onion ring crisps. I haven't had them in so long, but they have onion rings, hot and spicy crisps. So they sound like totally up my street, these. Um, okay, let's see the little thingy on them, reading the manual. Let's see what their description for this item is. Crunchy onion flavoured rings made of flour and fried to a crispy perfection in vegetable oil. If you're lucky, you may get the hot flavour, which I did. Whoop, whoop. Hot flavoured onion rings, literally a vibe. Cannot wait to try these and the packaging is so cool. I love the packaging of all these items. We have then got, the, honestly this box is endless, like the value for money in this box is just out of this world. So good. 
Choco Pie, delicious taste, original. Okay, let's read it first, Harriet. Don't get ahead of yourself. Choco Pie, a snack cake consisting of two small round layers of cake with marshmallow filling. OMG. And delicious chocolate covering. Now, these remind me of the double decker chocolate biscuits you used to get in your packed lunch. If you know, when you go to school and you'd get like a double decker in your, in your packed lunch. This is like the Korean version of a double desk decker. Love it. It doesn't look like it. Let me know in the comments if you agree with me. That looks like a double um, decker. Is that, what, is that what they used to call them? I'm pretty sure that's what they used to call them. But yeah, love this. I said love this like to every item in this haul, but I actually love all the items in this snack box review and I just think it's it's such good value for money. The next item I got was, there's actually two items left, oh yeah there's two items left here. So we have got some, it looks like chewing gum, it looks like the South Korean version of chewing gum but let's have a look. Okay it's not chewing gum so it's sour, sour fruit chews that will make your lips smack. Your box can include grape, peach or strawberry flavoured chews and I have got strawberry Get in. Love strawberry. Um, so they're like quite spicy. I think I'm gonna like I'm gonna take these around from mum and dad's garden. Obviously at the moment in Scotland we're still not allowed in in England you're allowed social bubbles, so you're allowed in other people's houses, but at the moment we're just allowed in the garden in Scotland. So I think I'm gonna go around and give one to my little brother, one to my little sister, and we can all and and me and we can all enjoy the sourness together. Last but not least in my snack surprise UK box, we have got um something mon is it Monche? Yeah. Monche spongy soft cake refreshing filled with white cream and sweetly covered with premium tempered chocolate. It looks amazing. But the vibe I'm getting from this, this South Korean sort of style of food, they like a lot of spongy sweet kind of cakes kind of thing with like chocolate coverings and um, that's the kind of thing I'm getting from their... Um, from the um, from the, the box, everything that's in the box is sort of I'm getting that they like maybe like sweet sweets um, they, they like a lot of honey flavoured crisps is another vibe I'm getting but yeah I really enjoyed this haul thank you so so much Snack Surprise um, UK for um, gifting me this box I am so excited by it and I know that from even showing my dad he was like I'm getting your little brother one of them he would absolutely love it so yeah I think it's a really fun thing to look forward to coming in the post each month it's great value for money because there's so many snacks and it will literally fill your cupboard for at least a week or so or it depends how many snacks you'd like a day I mean I like quite a lot of snacks but it really will fill your cupboard up and it's such good value for money so yeah let me know in the comments if you would like me to review any other monthly subscription boxes because I really had fun filming this today and yeah thank you so so much for watching and i will see you all real soon in my next video bye guys